I will be speaking on Christ nation. Christ nation. Now, I would like you to know that there is a country called Christ. There is a country called Christ and the citizens of that country are called Christians. This country is the only safe place in the world. You don't need to buy a car to travel to that country. All you need is Jesus. The moment you accept Jesus, automatically you'll be relocated to that country called Christ. No crime there. So armed forces are not needed. The motto of that country is peace and righteousness. The name of Jesus is their weapon. In that country, the name of Jesus is the weapon they use to fight. It's the weapon they use for defense. Don't forget this. There is a country called Christ. The, the citizens of that country are called Christians. So if you are a Christian, you must understand that you are living in Christ's nation. I'm not a citizen of, uh, <laughs> of any other place. I'm a citizen of Christ's nation. I belong to Christ's nation. I live there. So I have peace. Those who are living in this nation called Christ do not experience crisis because the economy of that nation is stable. There is peace there. Absolute peace. But this country is opened only to those who have surrendered to Jesus. So if you have not surrendered to Jesus, it means that you have not found that nation called Christ. Not to talk of living in it. And I can assure you there is no place in this world that is safe. There is no place in this world that is safe. Except you come into Christ. That's why you see the Bible saying, in him we live and have our being. Meaning that in him, the word him there is pointing to Christ. So Christ is not just a person. Christ is also a place. You can live in him. You can raise your children in Christ. But before you can begin to raise your children in Christ, you must first come into him. When you come into him, then you can raise your family in Christ. When you raise your family in Christ, of course your children will be Christ-like. You can start a business in Christ. You can start your ministry in Christ. You can do everything you want to do in Christ. That's why the Bible says, in him we live and have our being. Meaning, everything we want to become, we can become it in Christ. Having our being in Christ means becoming all that we want to become in Christ. Functioning to our fullest capacity in Christ. Don't forget once again, there is a country called Christ. The citizens of that country are called Christians. You need to belong to that country. So that you can enjoy the benefit of God to the fullest. Receive grace in the name of Jesus. This is the wisdom of God. Don't sell it.